MDB 二是 Crit Him。Yeah, get some MP back. No, my power buffs. How dare you! All right, well. Guess we're hitting him first. Oh, nice crit. Not killing this ball, this planet isn't gonna come bite me in the ass. Oh my god! Okay, wow. Okay, that definitely um, come come back and bite me. Okay, sure. Yeah, I wanted another turn. That's why I used Luminous Mirage. Yeah, Morningstar really need to be taken care of ASAP. Hold on, we'll get back. Sure. He is definitely not as tough as the uh, the the living abyss. I forgot what his name. It starts with a Y or something. He's definitely not as strong as him. Yeah, you're done.
All right. I'm gonna lower the um. Uh. Okay. So this that's it for SMT5. I think there's an, like an ending back uh somewhere, but uh. Yeah, all in all, it was pretty good. Uh, when I first started, I didn't really think this was worth making a new game. I thought this might be like a, might be worth an expansion or DLC. But as, as a, um, when the story kept going and the, we got to like the third area, which is the new big area they built, the Sinjuku area, I think it's called. When they when the game got to the new area they built, I realized, yeah, this is uh, actually a new game. And after there, uh, just when uh, I kept, it just kept going. Uh, when, I, I, when I started this playthrough, I was wondering if this is gonna be like pers uh, SMT three when they add like a just added a new dungeon, or is it gonna be like SMT four when they added like a whole new storyline? It was somewhere in between, but I think I prefer the SMT four Apocalypse one, where it's just like a completely new character and a new story you can you can play through. That's par that's happening like parallel or even sometimes after the um or as after the the event of SMT four. I wanted them to do like a story another Nahabino who is parallel to uh, to the SMT five one, and uh, you are just playing as him, but apparently not. Uh, there's some there a lot of the imp game improvement is pretty good. The only th problem I have is which the potential rails. Which they, the game, it's really hard to tell which one that you have already taken and which one you haven't, and it's hard to tell where where they're going just by looking at like the small minimap. Because sometimes it'll go way off, like off the buns of the the minimap that's on your screen, so you don't even know where it actually is gonna take you. So that's my probably my only concern as far as like the gameplay wise goes. The added new skills they got in this game is really cool and. Uh, like I said, I always wanted to do like a pure strength build in uh, my past MT SMT uh, playthroughs. I never actually got a chance to it uh, for it, but yeah, uh, I got it. I did it this time. It was fine. I I wasn't having that much trouble up until like the demi thing. I, I even beat like Shiva, which I down, which I like m many uh, much problems. I beat the like, Shiva first try too, but the demi thing is just still a kind of messed up boss. Um, I stand by what I said in my original SMT5 playthrough. They basically like lowered the difficulty of the of the SMT5, but they added all of the difficulty into into the demi thing, which basically just makes them one of the hardest boss in this franchise. Uh, kind of a mess up thing to do. I'm not gonna lie. Um, again, I didn't beat him in this playthrough, but I did beat him in my original SMT5 playthrough. If you want to see how I did it, go to that one. Go watch that uh, that fight. Um, there's no new super boss th th in this game, so like I don't really. S uh, I, so I just didn't really bother fighting the demi thing. Um, I I might come back to this game at some future point, but not for like a long, not gonna be for a long while. If I ever want to play this game, I'll probably come back. And I'll probably do like a new game plus, um, just to see what Yuko's ending. I want to fight Master Mom. I still want to fight Master Mom, but like, you know, uh, I'll probably come back just to fight Master Mom. Um, I'd maybe mess, mess with the teams a little bit more, try to get a better team, because the team I have, let's be honest, like half of the, the new demons I decide to keep in this game are just like useless. Um, so yeah, I wish they put a little, little bit more thought into the new demons um, they, they had in this game again, but you know. Uh, what, what are you gonna do? So, what I I don't know. What else am I trying to say? Uh, th no, this is this is I don't. Oh, okay. So the game was marketed to you don't have to you don't have to play the uh, the original original SMT five to enjoy the the vengeance. That's a lie. You need to have to play SMT five to understand like. A lot of the main plot points of the uh, SMT5 vendors, like Nahabino. Nahabino was a big concept in SMT5, but in this one, it's kind of hand wavy. And also, you need to play SMT5 to realize what the uh, the Army of Chaos, like the third star fight, was all about. Otherwise, you're just not gonna, you're just gonna get confused because like it's just a simulated battle that you have to go through. Like, you will be co really confused if you haven't played SMT. Uh, the original SMT5. 
Oh no, I think I'll give this game a, a, a 8.5. I don't believe... Uh, hold on. If I... Let's say this. I haven't played the original 75 in a while, but if the original 75 was an 8.5, I think this is a 8.8. It's not quite like a big enough leap for me to give it a 9, but it's definitely like a huge improvement on the original, I feel like. So, yeah. Um, I think that, that's it. I want to see, this is supposed to be the law ending of the, the, uh, the, the uh, ending of order, the law ending for, uh, because I choose, the game made me choose tall for, um, to side witch. So this is going to be the law ending. I wonder what the law ending is going to be. I think it's recreating the world. Usually the law ending is like just recreating the world or like upholding the status quo or something. Oh, hi, you are back. Why are you back? The boundless potential of the world's beginning will bring peace. Where once there was instability. The Empyrean and the throne of creation shall become a cradle and shall encircle all of its wonder. has been, every world that will be, shall be nurtured within this infinite universe. And there, a paradise shall be born, a world where all wishes are fulfilled and none denied. Harold Mastermall has been unlocked for fusion. Okay. Lady Noir has been unlocked for fusion. Virtual Streamer Battle, Battle to Preserve the World has now available. Clear Save Data. Clear Save Data. Preparing the Save Data by loading the Clear Save Data, you'll be able to start a new game plus. In order to do so, you'll be able to carry over certain elements. Yeah, right. Okay. Warning when saving. Yeah, I got it. Alright. So that's the Clear Save Data. Okay, so there's like. There's six endings? Uh, okay, I don't... Wait, isn't there like... There's originally three endings in SMT5, but... Why does it say it has like six endings? I don't get it. Alright, um, so... If you are... If for those of you who are watching on YouTube, um... That's it for the SMT5. I will, um... I will, I'm also currently streaming Xenoblade Chronicles 2 and Fire Emblem uh, Three Houses Blue Lion playthrough. And uh, I have like an hour left on this stream. I'm going to close this. I'm going to go use the restroom after this. But I'm going to close the game and do like an uh, hour of um, maybe 40 minutes of uh, Fire Emblem Three Houses playthrough. And um, and just to uh, just to get to like three hours on this stream. Uh, so yeah, I will be pl the next new game I'm gonna play on the channel is uh, I'm going to be playing Black Myth Wukong. When it comes out on October 20th, maybe 19th, because it comes, comes out on October 20th on in China, so like, it might come out in 19th on, on the US. So I might play, uh, so I might be playing that on the 19th, but uh, yeah, that's when that game comes out. Uh, but before that, I'm going to be uh, playing Xenoblade Chronicles 2 and Fire Emblem 3, House, 3 Houses Blue Lion playthrough. So I'm going to be playing those two. So yeah. Um, if you are watching this on YouTube, leave a like, subscribe, comment if you want. If you want to watch it live on Twitch, I'll leave the channel down in the description. See you guys all next time. Goodbye.